What's up guys, it's Cher talking and today's video is the last challenge for Battle with King Say event. The Saga 3 RS3, Unlimited Saga and Saga RS. What's up guys, this is Cher talking, welcome back to my channel. In today's video we'll do the last challenge for the event called Battle with King Say. This time limited to the series 3, that means Saga 3. Romancing Saga Tree, Unlimited Saga, and the Saga RS Regionals. I do believe that this is the easiest one, because you can bring Mantrak. Mantrak is the best character in the game. Not just that, but also Leon, also Rag Robin, and even Golden Ball. Those are the most important characters from this build. Well, I am using the Tortoise Shell Formation because of many reasons. First, I am buffing Dexterity and Will with Mantrak. But also Love and Charisma, that means that the Tortoise Shell Formation will heal even more. This boss has many uh, problems with speed, so sometimes he attacks before us, sometimes after us, so Tiger's Den was never on full potential. So I decided to bring Matra here together with Kid Monica, that also buffs Charisma, so the heals will get stronger. She also buffs Dexterity, that will also help Leon, the main damage dealer, and I'm bringing the sack on Leon because if he gets killed, he just revives. And I inherited Wind Revolver instead of just using something else. Uh, we use full power shot, but by the time I use this, the boss is already dead. Uh, then we have Rag Robin in the front line because he heals and he counters, very nice. But then we also have Golden Ball. Can be this version, can be the newest one. Don't matter the version because we just want to buff Endurance when she gets hit. Even if she's not too focused, she still uh, helps a lot. But there's something very important. I brought the uh, Titan Suit and also brought this equipment called Charming Dress. You may even choose to bring her the Proof of War the Tower just to allow her to survive better because she's weak to elementals and the HP drain attack is actually a sun spell. Now let's talk about in now let's talk about replacements. Darius, a character that I don't have, works pretty well here because he can do damage and self-heal just fine. I think Robin Joe will work well as well because she can inherit an AoE spell that deals damage and heals from the newest S style. Besides, um, I guess that... Now let's talk about replacements. Darius, a character that I don't have, will also work well here. Robin Joe can also work by inheritance of her AoE Sun spell that also heals from the newest S style. Uh, this new Boston also works with Pincer Time, he's gonna counter here and there. You can also use Mirage Kick to debuff the skeletons, but some of these attacks are just spells and this will not matter much. Uh, Aonus can also work as a healer. There is Leonid for BP battery if you are bringing Polka and you want to heal more often. Genryu can be used as a healer, the Snowy. And uh, this version of Bertrand negates some damage, you can place it on the front line, he also counters direct attacks and can self-heal. Just not a very good damage dealer, but will also work. Uh, from the styles that I have, besides just Undine and Building can also work, but they are not exactly optimal for this fight. Well, with all that said, let's watch the run. 